Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nog. Welcome back to Soccer Ban, the RPG episode number 27. As we left off, we finally got to the end of the riddle after a lot of hard work and um, a bit of a miswrite from me. But uh, yeah, we've ended up in this weird basement area here. The body of a young girl appears to lie lifeless in a small cage. You don't know how she may have gotten there, as the bars seem to be in impenetrable and there is no sign of a door. Suddenly, the body of the young girl twitches, and as her mouth opens, words start flowing out in a rather monotone fashion. Through, though her lips remain completely still. I'm so hungry. Do you have something to eat? I do have an apple for you. Here you go. He reached to the bars and placed the apple in the little girl's hand. She seemed to hold on to it very tightly, as if it was a really precious gift from someone special. I'm in so much. I'm in so much pain. Do you have something to ease the pain? I do have this weird liquid. I don't know if it helps, but might just as well give it a shot. Best container of an unknown liquid in the girl's hand. Her body remains completely still. The pain is gone, but it will return. Do you have something to help the wound heal? Well, I happen to have a few bandages. I found them quite a while back. I took the bandages and placed a few on you had left on the floor in between the little girl's legs. Her legs moved ever so slightly in response. Thank you. Now my agony will be finite. I'm still so hungry. Might you have any food still? I'm sorry, but I'm all out of food. Thanks, sis. You really helped me out. What? No problem. One last request. Do you happen to have a knife with you? I'm afraid I am not currently in the possession of a knife. Oh, that's fine. I'll just stay here forever. Don't worry, Luce. Go on ahead. I'll stay here forever. Uh, so that's my, is that my sister? No way, you must be joking. It's still snowing, right? The temperature's freezing. This is downright insanity. Well, back to ten hopping again, I guess. There's a Tom look. Let's give a save. Tom, at last, you returned. It seems that I have my may I have. May I ask something first? Uh sure. Have you noticed something strange about the sky? Apart from it's just like a picture. LB mentioned something about that. Now that you mention it, the moon looked a bit off. I can recall it being full at first, but then later I saw a crescent moon. If I look up now, it's full again. How is that possible? Beats me, but yeah, that was indeed what I was getting at. So how are the puzzles going? At first I found them fairly straightforward, but I have the feeling that they're slowly getting more complicated. Yeah, I have that too. By the way, in the, in the ballroom when I last saw you, you suddenly disappeared right in the middle of me solving a puzzle. Where did you go? Me? I simply proceeded up, up to the next room. A door suddenly opened up, allowed me to leave. Really? I seem to recall you explicitly stating that we were stuck in a corner with no doors whatsoever. Oh, did I say that? You must have been understood. I meant there were no unlocked doors, of course. Oh, okay. I just found it a little odd. You had me really worried for a second. I apologise, it was not my intention. What are you doing? I try to get this fire going. I, for one, did not have the luxury of a fully equipped tent. Just go on solving these puzzles and hurry a bit, will you? We don't have all day. What's gone into him all of a sudden? I better continue quickly, I'm starting to freeze again already. Alright. Let's loosen up. As we get back on to the puzzles. New music. Very nice, very nice. So... That's gonna come down. Undo that move. Yeah, I need to get around there and push them out there. Don't wanna do that move. Didn't wanna really wanna do that move. Right, I have messed up big time. So, um, Tracks quite nice. I 
I can't get around the back of these though. They're trapped in there. come across first. So that's not the right thing to do. I can't get one here in a holding area. It's got to come in from the top. So this is going to have to be a path that I remove around. Same thing again with these two down here. Plop them in. Okay, I can't I can't see clearly like a distinctive opening move, which is always frustrating. When you can't see how to get going. do that because then that pops in there. I can't get there and get around the bottom. Can't do this though. I'll undo that move. Come round. I don't like making excuses, but I feel like my head's still a bit mushed from that um, that riddle that we took up in the last episode. I think getting this one out early is key.
We can't do that though because I need to be able to push this one down. And that traps all them in there on that right hand side. So. This one on the right, top right, has got to come all the way down to either here or the one in the space above. Which I can do like that, then I'm all blocked in on the left hand side now. There's just like no. can't find that middle ground at the minute. anything else or anything else so do anything else or anything else wow there but see this is I, I, I can't get this other one out now No matter what I did, what I do, that's, I, I, I can't get into any sides, but that was better progress than what we have been making, that's for sure. Still need to get around the top though, so I can't push that in at the moment. I'm doing that screws me. Possibly make this work. No, because 
I got them too low on the left hand side there. We just taken a massive difficulty spike here or what? Hard to tell. there. It's no good for us. Saying they've got them in position. I can push one in. So I need to get one to the top now. Then the ones in on the left. Finally, the ones in on the right. I believe. Can't block the top off yet, though. Pretty sure that wants doing last. in this episode. This is not good progress. We've come to a snowy halt. So that's what I had, right? That pushed down, that one pushed across. 
Yeah. So that would have to push down there. So next move, I need to move this one in. Something like that, though. That's something I hadn't given any thought to. Okay. Do that. I need to clear this area. That one needs to come down there before I block off the gap between the lamppost and the tree. Um, well. Well, well, well. blocked in, I can't get into them. Alright guys, I'm going to have to leave it there. We have made no progress in this episode whatsoever, which is a little bit annoying, but um, hopefully, fingers crossed, when we come back to the game, we will make um, a bit more headway, but thank you very much for sticking with it and tuning in today, guys. I'll be back real soon with another episode of Soccer Band, the RPG, but until next time, I've been you've been awesome. See ya.